One of the hardest things about leaving a person is that you end up leaving a life, right? You end up leaving nieces and nephews you cared about. You ended up leaving maybe a mother-in-law or family members, you know, whatever else it is. When we create change, we like some of the consequences and we don't like other consequences, right? And so one of my private, uh, in the pe one of the ladies in the Wondrous Woman group asked the question about missing his family. And she told me story after story after story of doing right by his family, of taking care of his family. And then it's like, okay, Sarah, what words, what, what's one phrase I can use to talk this mother into seeing the truth about her son? And I was like, she probably saw the truth about her son when he was four. And she didn't do a dang thing about it. She wanted to be the nice person too. She wanted to enable the paper behavior. She thought, hoped it would just all go away. Rome was not built in a day, my friends. You know, his, if it's a him, his bad behavior was not built in a day. And so then when you try to convince his family to see the truth about him, it's the most important people who are not going to see the truth about him. Because then they have to accept some type of responsibility too. Yeah, I should have seen it. Yeah, I shouldn't have enabled him. Yeah, I shouldn't have covered it up. Okay? So if you are missing the family, it's normal. It's okay. Create a beautiful life for yourself. Play the long game. Create other people in your life that are not connected to him. Find new people in your life that are not connected to him. I would say that 50 times if I could. <laughs> Find new people in your life that are not connected to him that can become safe people for you because the people most closely connected to the toxic person are not very likely to be your safe people. Now, if you play the long game and you see, they see your happiness, they see you in a healthy relationship, they see you thriving, and they see him pulling the same crap over and over and over and over again, it's going to be much easier for you at that point to then create a relationship with him. But at the beginning, the trick is, ugh, I miss them. This sucks. This is not where I want to be. This is not where I thought I would be. Okay, this is where I'm at. And how can I create a new life for myself? How can I create new safe relationships for myself? How can I create new situations for myself that aren't just constant reminders of him? And how can I bounce back better, right? That's the reason my business's name is Bounce Back Better. And that's really what it is and really playing that long game. And when you, when you are, you know, I, I say the best revenge is creating a beautiful life for yourself, right? And the more beautiful your life is and the, the stark contrast, right, of oh, this is what it was and this is what it is. And it's so much better over here. That's when people start believing you. Okay, so... Action plan, create that beautiful life for yourself. Have a great day.